New tonight, a 10 a surveillance camera company is being accused of security sharing your private information. NBC Local 33's Jonah Gilmore went knocking, or in this case, ringing doorbells to see how safe you feel with these new gadgets. Hey, 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 get away. They are used to catch package thieves, animals invading your doorstep, and help law enforcement catch criminals. Now, the popular ring doorbell is capturing and sharing something different, your personal information. I saw the report online and I looked at it. And it was obvious they are sending metadata, but it, it never said what they were really sending. According to a report posted on USA Today, the Amazon-owned company shares tons of users' personal information with companies including Facebook, even if you don't have a Facebook account. It does not make me feel good at all, because that could technically be buying on my network, for all I know. Michael Chazon says he thought the Ring doorbell was a great investment, but now he's having a second thought. It's a worrisome thing to know. People say they installed doorbell cameras for safety concerns, but seeing this report that says a company could be sharing their private information is alarming. If the information is uh, being shared without my knowledge, I'm not happy with that. According to the report, the Ring doorbell app is packed with third-party trackers. It says the app is sending out customers customer's personal information and it's done without the user's consent. When I purchased the doorbell, the doorbell was for, for like I said, safety reasons and not for my information to be all over the internet or in other people's possession that I have no, no clue as to who they are. They just should tell you or they should at least ask you if it's okay. Studies show several companies use this metadata from their devices, but it's done with the customer's knowledge. Shazon says if rain comes forward alerting customers of what they're doing, it'll put him at ease. I'm not going to take it down. I'm, I'm not so worried that I'm going to rip it out. I'm not. I would like to see the company put a patch out and say, okay, if you want to, don't want to do this anymore, here's what you can do. Jonah Gilmore, NBC Local 33 News.